I know you wanna be like me Pop on a lash and see how I see I know you see me on TV Looking so snatch with lashes on flea I know that you mad cause I'm free I vote the house down with cameras on me Hair with the dreads or wigs and they beat I have a team constituency Hey guys, welcome back to the channel Whew. I still have a clip in my head Anyways Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. Today is December 11th. It is now 9.30 and I had to turn on my ring light to shoot this video. Oh, excuse me. To shoot this video because it is still dark and gloomy outside because it's going to be a rainy ass day. So we are a week into December, which means I am a week late for Vlogmas. So I'm not doing Vlogmas, but... I am going to be vlogging, but it won't probably be every day because I don't do shit but work and play The Sims for the most part right now. So today we are going to work. Y'all going to come with me to see how I do my job as a beauty advisor at Dillard's. I work for Lancome and yeah, so I'm about to actually get up and shower and all that good stuff and then y'all can sit with me while i do my makeup so y'all can see that whole process so i'm about to get up and get ready so first i'll put on my primer i picked this primer up because i noticed the primers that i was using with my long home foundation was not giving me the long lasting effect that i that i've been looking for and then I found out that the foundation is actually kind of silicone based. So I needed a silicone based primer. And that's why I picked up this Benefit Pour, Pour Primer, the Pour Professional. And it was my, this is my first time really using it this week. And I can say I kind of like it. I, I actually like it a lot. It's a, a, a um, primer that I know I'll pick up again. Let's say that. So like I said, um, majority of my face when I'm going to work is Lancome. I am still a Maybelline Too Faced Stan, but this Lancome foundation, this shit is amazing. I'm going to use a beauty two pumps. I usually color correct, but like I said, I'm pressed for time. This is going to be a really quick face today. Will not be one of my best. But if you follow me on Instagram, you will be able to see some of my best looks. So I picked up these Makeup Revolution concealers because I ran out of my go-to, which is the Too Faced one. So I picked up some Makeup Revolution ones. And then under the eye, I'm going to use a Lancome concealer. This Lancome concealer is the fucking bomb it's very thick it lasts all day and the coverage is amazing like seriously and all my brushes are not clean so that's another reason why i'm not showing y'all everything too because i don't want y'all to see the brushes that i have that's been dirty from me using them all week but don't worry, I will be cleaning them tonight. I'm going to be picking up some uh, brush cleaner while I'm at work too for this discount day. Because I'm cheap. And I was going to just go get, you know, some dial soap. But since it's discount day, I will get the usual that I use, which is the Sigma, the Sigma brush cleaning gel. Live for that stuff, okay? It's good. The beauty cleaner, um have some good stuff too now why did i just put all this concealer on my face like this and i was going to use the damn makeup revolution ones whatever i'm gonna use the one that's in my closer to my skin tone though. so this is makeup revolution in the say in the shade c12 when i conceal under the eye with a lighter uh concealer i also use one closer to my skin tone just to even out even out the tones the tones the tones so I don't get that flashback effect. And then I'll just take the tip of my beauty blender and blend these things into place. Okay, now for contour. So today we're gonna do a powder bronze 
And I'm going to be using this Morphe 8H, yeah, 8H Highlight and Contour Palette. I love this palette, highly recommend y'all pick it up. Today I'm going to dip into the shade Blogger. And get into those cheekbone areas, a little bit on my forehead. Mm -hmm. Blend this all out. And then we're going to get to setting things in place. Now, I should have put this under the eye. I am a dry skin girl, so I don't really bake. For the most part, I just place it under and pat it in place and get into my lap lines and then I dust it all out and then contour the nose. So I'm still using the shade blogger. I'm just going to be dusting this right across the lid just to bring life into the face add a little bit of bronzer this is the Too Faced chocolate gold as you see i must really like it because i'm running out of it so now i'm going to take a pressed powder to set this in place. See how white and pale that looked at first? That's why I say use this because it's going to bring color back into your skin where you need it to be. And this is not too far off from my foundation either. So it's okay. So we're gonna fill in the brows. Spray, spray, spray. I don't have the Lancome La Boss setting spray. Because right now in this lifetime, in this moment, I'm not trying to spend $20 for it. And like I said, between work, I wear Maybelline. So that was the Maybelline Lasting Fix Setting Spray. One of my favorites. That's drugstore. Morphe is good too. This is the NYX, that's the point, hella fine eyeliner. And for this part, I have to turn. Because I'm not the best at a wing. So this is the part where I'm gonna start. So now I'm going in with the Lancome Seals Booster XL. This is a lash primer, so it is white. You wanna move relatively quick for, for this step if you're gonna pick this up because it do dry down kind of quick. So what I do is I apply this on the lash and then right after, I go in with the mascara that I'm going to use. And this one today is going to be the Lancome Definiseals. So this is just to add a little bit of length and definition to my natural lashes. I do have the Hypnose Drama, which adds a little bit more volume. But today, because this is a rushed look, I just want to use this one. Boom! Spray one more time. Just real lightly that time. And then this is our look for the day. So now I'm about to go get dressed and then I'm gonna talk to y'all in the car. Okay, I am in the car. I'm fully ready to go. I need to put on some lotion, but I'll do that when I get to work because I'm gonna use our soft cream. So it is gloomy, wet, and rainy outside. I am fully ready, like I said. Here's my press on nails, accessories, and all that good stuff. Now the good thing is, oh, I hate this. I'm gonna have to get a goddamn phone holder for the car. So the good thing is, I made it a little bit, a few minutes ahead of time. So I do have time where I can stop and possibly grab me a sandwich. Y'all, I made it. I made it 30 minutes ahead of time, so I do have time to get my sandwich. I'm literally up the street from the McDonald's. Um, I will be pulling in. What the fuck? I will be pulling into the drive-thru to order. It will be a line. But 
hopefully I'm not sitting here too long. I'm like the third car, so. We shall see. Shall see. What's wrong with my words today? I can't talk. Thick to my mouth. Hi. May I please have a sausage egg McMuffin? Okay, would you like the meal? No, just the sandwich. And may I also have a small orange juice? Small orange juice? Okay. Yes. Would you like to try your apple pudding today? No, I don't. Okay, you're going to be fine, baby. Thank you. Thank you. Mm hmm mm. That speaker usually don't work. I was shocked. Guess that made it a little faster. They must know they got a line out here today. Let me get my wallet. Get my wallet for y'all. Or for them. Okay, y'all. Hi, good morning. Well, afternoon. It's not morning. Thank you, appreciate you. So, who was that finna say? Should've got ice water. I don't know why I got this damn orange juice. Look, I'm holding people up. Oh, I'm the only car. Oh, okay. She did not got to throw my orange juice out like that. Hi. Thank you, appreciate it. Let me find up. Anyway, so I got my food. Let's get to Dillard's. I made it in time. So, I'm going to put this phone so y'all can, so we can chit chat for a bit. I don't know. I don't want to hold the phone. Well, this is what's gonna happen because I need to eat and I'm pressed for time at this point. I'm about to eat my sandwich, drink my orange juice. Did she give me a straw? Okay. And then, yeah, sorry about the fingerprint. And then I'm gonna go clock in, talk to my manager, see if I can vlog and all that stuff. Look what she did, what the fuck? Look at my sandwich. How? How? Anyway, let me eat and get myself together. I'll talk to y'all when I can. Thanks for riding with me and I'll see y'all in a bit. Okay, so I am on my lunch break and I'm walking around the mall. It's a snack store in the mall that sell only junk food and waters and all that stuff. So I stopped in there, got me some water, got me some cookies because I honestly don't know what I want to eat. I'm tired of eating fast food. Um... I'm waiting on a sales associate to get back to the counter at my job so I can purchase my stuff I have on hold. Unfortunately, y'all, I cannot record at work. So that's why I didn't have nothing to show you because I couldn't have my phone out. So I'm like, you know what, I'll just walk around the mall instead. So right now, I'm trying to figure out what can I eat so I don't have to drive to Chipotle because I do not want to eat there again right now. I honestly might not eat anything for lunch. I might just find somewhere to take a nap. I'm kind of tired. Um, what? What else? Yeah, if I don't find a sandwich place, like a Subway or something, we might be sad for eating lunch. I might wait till I get home. But I wanted to pop in here and let y'all know why y'all was wondering where is the, you know, footage from work. I cannot record at all at Dillard's. So yeah, I'll just pop back in when I find somewhere to sit. So I found somewhere to sit. I wanna show y'all my finger. Why soon I got to work, I cut my damn finger open with some scissors. I was so salty. They don't look that bad. I'm actually cutting my damn circulation on. Let my finger breathe for lunch. 
the bleeding stop, so that works. I don't want to be too loud, so. Lunch right now is water. My favorite, some of my favorite cookies, and the rest of those. Oh no. Again, I don't really have much to talk about. So, how about we do this? Down below, y'all tell me. Besides a day in the life, besides get ready with me's, besides story times and makeup tutorials, what would y'all really like? I hate that I can't vlog at work. I'm trying to think of everything that I did today. I seriously haven't done nothing. <laughs> I mean, I rung up guests, of course, clients and stuff. I mean, I called a few people on the phone. We have a system called CAD, which stands for Clients at Dillard's. Everybody we interact with, we pretty much ask them to leave behind a name, phone number, possibly an email address. Because we sometimes have events in the store where you can enter yourself into the Zoom meetings right now because it's COVID. So we have to enter your name into the cash system. And you can meet with our makeup artist, our regional makeup artist, Robert Cook. If you follow Lancome on YouTube or Instagram, then you know exactly who he is. He's very talented. I have not had the opportunity to meet him yet. I do plan to sit in on one of our Zoom calls. It's just usually when he's doing these Zoom meetings, I am at Dillard's making sales. Um, I met another manager today in a different department who knew who I was because I told you guys I am top selling um, cosmetic beauty advisor right now. So my name is kind of circulating around the store. So it's bringing some people to the counter to introduce themselves to me. Um, honestly nothing else I mean I will walk around the mall and try to get clients and bring them into the store but for what at this point that's going, going on so I'm not off till Sunday Sunday I might do a makeup tutorial for y'all um yeah so that's about it so i get out of here tonight at 8 8 15 ish so i'll just talk to y'all at the end of my shift oh my god when i tell you motherfuckers i'm tired i am tired it is finally 8 15 and i am off work and i have to go pick up food so tonight's meal choice will be Chipotle. That's the only fast food that I think my stomach is going to allow me to eat right now because I'm over the heavy eating. So look, I'm gonna let them go ahead before they hit this Chevy because if they hit this Chevy, motherfuckers best be ready, okay? So anyway, Look at this, look at this. I can't afford that car, don't hit me because I'm gonna hit your shit and keep going, buddy. I oh, am. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, so we're about to head to Chipotle. Tear it up. Nuh -uh. I'm very basic with mine. Uh, check it. Uh huh. And then. Sour cream. Mm -hmm. You have any mild salsa? Which one was it? I'll take the hot. Not too much though. And they have shredded cheese and lettuce. And then that's gonna be it for me. Whew! I'm back in the house. I know I told y'all I wasn't gonna show y'all my food, but I had changed my mind when I got in there. <laughs> Tay felt like it'd have been a great idea that y'all saw it. Remy! Come on. Let me take this dog outside. She obviously, obviously think I'm her owner. You was not that happy to go outside. Big old self. Don't jump on me. 
Be careful. Go ahead, big mama. I'll be back. Let me close this door. Goodness gracious. She do that every day. Every day I come in the house. Even if somebody took her outside, she do that. I don't know where she got that from. I don't know what made her say, yeah, she gonna be doing take me outside. <laughs> well, y'all saw what I had ordered. I was telling y'all about my cookies this morning, so now I'm gonna finally show them to you. Somebody obviously touched them because they knocked upside down. Tell you who touched my cookies. Why? Oh, but yeah, y'all. These so good. I had got some. I got two chocolate chip cookies. I got the double chocolate chip cookie with the white chocolate chips. Fire! And then I got the chocolate chips and pecan. Is it pecan or pecan? I hear different ones depending on where I'm at. Either way, they're going to be good. And then here's the food from Chipotle. Oh, I forgot to tell y'all the good news. So the good news is I talked to my Lancome EP. And of course, they are so proud of me, as they should be. I'll be busting my ass. So yeah, and I found out today that we might possibly be getting a Christmas gift from our EP. So I'm excited about that. If y'all go on the Lancome.com website, y'all will see the beauty box. And I was told we supposed to get one for Christmas, fingers crossed. We just don't know yet because of the whole COVID situation. I, I kind of feel my ways about the beauty box only because some of that stuff I already have. But who turns down free skincare and free makeup? I sure don't. And I really, really like the bag. I would love to have that pink bag. So it'll come in handy for when I go home to visit Milwaukee. So, so right now I am actually going to wash my face and shower before I eat because I want to get comfortable. I have to be back up early tomorrow for work. There will not be a vlog tomorrow. Y'all probably won't see me until Sunday. Um, I'm debating on if I'm going to come back on here and vlog or not for the rest of the night. I don't really have nothing to tell y'all. Actually, no, I'm going to be done. So, yeah. It was fun hanging out with y'all. Thank you for watching this video. I will see y'all next video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.